っちゃ楽しいデュエルにしようぜ<笑> Hello guys,、um, welcome to my deck profile for the YCS、uh, Rio,、uh, Rio de Janeiro. I played Heroes and I got、uh, 33rd place.、Uh, unfortunately, I, I couldn't top, but I still got pretty close, so I, I, I take that as a win.、Um, so, for the main deck, I, I'm playing.、Uh, for the Elemental Heroes, I'm playing two Straddles. One Shadow Mist, one Liquid, and one Eos.、Uh, you don't need more than one Stratos because it's not really a great normal summon. You, you like to normal summon it, but it, it doesn't do enough on its own. That's why you don't play、uh, three. And you can special it with a, a Hero Leaf, so it's fine. You don't need more than one Shadow Mist. I never miss e d miss the second one, so one is enough. Uh, you play one liquid, uh, one liquid to, uh, to draw two with,、uh, in the middle of your combo. You draw two, you get,、uh, you get more non engine, you get more interaction, you, you extend a lot. It, it's really good. You play this, you play Neos because it's an engine requirement. Star like Neos, yeah.、Uh, you, you have to play it because it's, a,、uh, it's a, a, an engine requirement.、Garnage. It's a garnet, but you. You end up with a pretty, pretty big board with that. So, for the Destiny Heroes, you're playing three malicious. I've seen some people say that you don't need three, two is enough, and I kind of agree with that. But three malicious makes the deck so much better, so much, so much more resilient. So, I think you have to play three.、Uh, one denier because it's a, it's a free special summon,、uh, extends a lot of combos. And、uh, one plasma because、uh, this year I made it a lot、uh, going second. It helped, me, it helped me break a lot of boards, so it is a mandatory card. I don't think you can cut it. Uh, uh, basically, it's skill drain, so、uh, I stole a lot of games with plasma.、Uh, for the vision heroes, I'm playing the standard package、uh, three fairies, three increase. Uh, two increase to Vion.、Uh, this because it's your main starter, it's the, be it's the best、uh, starter of the deck. You play two because if you draw it, you still need one on the deck. I think now that we have the Neos combo, you need to resolve fairies, so you have to play two because、uh, you need it in the deck in order for the combo to go on. And to Vion,、uh, kind of for the same reason, it doesn't. It, It, it doesn't do a lot of, on its own, but it's a better number of summon the, than Stratos.、Uh, that, that's it for the hero monsters.、Uh, next, we have the spells. I'm playing three hero leaves because it's a,、uh, it specials、uh, a hero monster from the、uh, an elemental hero monster from the deck.、Uh, you usually special summon Stratos, but you can also special summon Shadow Mist to search. Uh, mass change early on, and you force an interaction with that, so it's a, it's a really good card.、Uh, you need to play three. I sighted out sometimes if I was getting close to time, but overall, it's a, it's a, really, good it's a really good card. You need to play that. I'm playing three Fusion Destinies because it's a one card combo, it's a one card starter, and、uh, it's a really good extender. If you open a full combo plus Fusion Destiny, You can,、uh, extend. you can extend and make two Dark Claws on your field, and that's pretty huge against the Fire Metal. You need,、uh, I guess, against Fire decks, you kind of need two Dark Claws because they can out it very easily. So, having two Dark Claws is it's broken. There's only a one card combo, two, two, m e l e t h r e It's、no. a three card combo, but it's really easy. Oh, yeah, but it's m e l e t h r e Better than Brain Dead Fusion. Me Melia 3,、uh, yeah, Melia 3 also makes Fusion Destiny uh, uh, a combo that extends a lot more. And it's more resilient. It, it makes the, deck, the combo more resilient. It's, it's amazing.、Uh, Fusion Destiny is it's an amazing card and it's even better now because of the Mighty s h o e s For Extenders, I'm playing one Rota, one Foolish. Uh, uh, There are searchers. It, yes, searchers. This extends、uh, really, really well. This starts combo. I had one game where I, I had a party in hand and just foolish. 
And I still ended with uh, the full combo. Sure, sure. The, except I didn't have Dark Law, but like I didn't need it. Uh, I'm playing one map change because you really don't need to. Uh, it's uh, you only need the one. You can recycle it with Mist uh, to make the double Dark Law. One poly, one miracle disc uh, because you need it. Uh, you don't, you can't play more because you can't search more, and you recycle this with, uh, with, with driver two. So yeah, you play one of the trap to make shining new Wigman on, on your opponent's turn. Uh, now for the non engine, I'm playing thirteen non engine three ash blossom. Uh, I I think it it's overall the worst non engine of my deck. Uh, I, but I played it because I'm already playing the other better ones. Uh, Three Valor, this was the MVP, uh, target negation, it goes burn. <laughs> One call because hand traps, you need to defend yourself. Three Droplet, help me break boards, help me go first to... Help your addiction. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, three Permanence, again, uh, this is probably the better hand trap of the Permanence and uh, Target negation goes per. Yeah. So for the extra deck, I'm playing two, crus two crusaders because resilience. Resilience. You need the second one to extend. You need the second one for the comeback. So you need to play two. I'm playing one to search the Neos, so you don't have to waste your crusader on search Neos. I'm playing one driver. Honestly, I wanted to play two, but I couldn't find the space. Uh, it's a really good card. Uh, you recycle your fusions, your, your mask chains. It's amazing. I would play too if I, if I could. Link 3 helps OTK. Uh, I didn't make it a lot, but it helped me OTK a lot, so yeah. Uh, uh, now for the fusions. One sunrise to search the the Miracle Fusion. Also, One. Dry Decimator saves the game for you. Right? Yeah, Dry Decimator saves the game for me. Uh, one Neos search to the trap. One yeah. uh, Flame Wing to search the trap. Uh, I ha we had to change places because the, uh, w they were going to use the tables. I, wa I was in to make a, a side event. So basically, uh, I think I said anything, everything I need about this card. It's it's not bad against Tempai, but I, I don't think you need it. Uh, the Tempais I faced, I. I won like it wasn't even close. Uh, I I got I two old them. Uh, for the now for the side deck I'm playing one Dark Angel. It's not good in the main deck in this format because of Link ones, but it's really good against some other matchups like Runic Stun, which I faced once, and I didn't have the chance to use it because I never started against it. But uh, if I if I got to play first against a Runic Stun, I would have used it. And it would have uh, completely break his strategy. I'm playing two, uh, two draw and lockbird. Uh, not a bad card. It won me games, but honestly, I think I would play just one because I'm playing cross out in the side. So I need it to the to the cross out uh, target. And since it's not an expected card, uh, it goes. Uh, it really goes hard when people don't play around it because no one's expecting it. So. Yeah, I play Tunibiru uh, because it it has a lot of good matchups. I also expected to to be more uh, to have for this event to have more rogue decks that lose Tunibiru. So I put it in the side. And honestly, it was a really good card. If you pair it with more uh, non-engine, it's basically turn skip for for any deck, even. Snake Eye, Fire, uh, Fire King, and as such. Cosmic Cyclone because floodgates like uh, uh, Deck Lockdown, uh, Skill Drain are still uh, are popular. So I played. Uh, it's also a great card against some decks like uh, Voiceless, um, Centurion. Fire King, Centurion. So it, uh, Tempai also kind of has a hard time against this because you can uh, cycle on their field spell, and it helps. To, uh, to play against it, so I think it's a really good card. You, I think you should play three. Uh, two cross out because draw. Ten, because of draw, yeah, but mostly because people. Uh, this meta is like very hand trap dependent. There, people are playing like 15, 18 hand traps. 
So you need so you need to play cross out so that you don't automatically lose to hang traps. So that's why I chose to play uh, cross out and playing uh, two talents. Honestly, I don't remember a single game where I used it, even the ones I cited. So I honestly would take out both of these for any other non-engine, uh, probably like more hand traps, uh, maybe Mourner, because I got Mourner a lot of times this, uh, this event, and I didn't have Mourner for the, uh, for the cross out. So I think I would change this for uh, uh, Mourner pretty easily. And finally, 3D Barrier, because it's really good this meta, it, uh, it kills Voiceless, it kills... Uh, I, don't, I, don't only, I don't know if, if it kills the, the Fusion deck, the... Uh, Melodious. Melo the Melodious. I, I don't know if, if it kills Melodious, but it, I don't think it's a bad card against it. Uh, it kills Temp... It basically kills Tempai if they enter the battle phase. Uh, the barrier is just such a broken card this format. I, uh, I chose to play it uh, as my final one in here. And that's the deck profile. Thanks for watching and remember to like, subscribe uh, to the channel and I'll see you in the next one.